There's nothing like chilling with my girls. Just me and my divas taking over the world. Hey love, so it is time for a full lace wig and this is actually from Jenny Lace Wigs. First time ever reviewing their hair and this wig is their Brazilian Loose Curl, 26 inches. It was supposed to be a glueless lace wig but it ended up being a full lace wig with combs on it. So I went ahead and decided to add some elastic to it because I was not about to adhere this to my head with any type of tapes and glues. I also had to tweeze the part a little bit once I washed it um, because the part, the the hairs or the knots was a little bit too much for me so I went ahead and washed it and co-washed it and while it was wet I did tweeze out just a tiny bit so you know the drill the infamous camouflage or concealer palette from Coastal Scents I'm gonna go ahead and take my favorite color that blends so well with my skin tone and I'm going to first apply that to the inner side of the unit and then for the outer side, I'm going to take just a little bit. I like to do both because that just ensures a proper, realistic looking part. It did come with these extra plastic combs, which I'm not going to be using. So I already have my leave out braided and I love to wear a wig cap because it ensures that my wig does not slip around and move. So that is the reason why I wear the wig cap. It has nothing to do with a flush tone. This is the actual concealer and that's the part that I tweezed. I didn't tweeze it too big, just a little bit. So I'm going to go right on into it and unbraid my leave out. And I do have some anchor braids in my hair, which are just basically braids that have extensions added to it only in the front portion of where the combs would um, just stick into my head. This helps my hair a lot so that the wig st doesn't move around and my hair doesn't pull. So one of my favorite hair filler fibers, which is Topic. I love this stuff. I highly suggest it. This is great for anyone who has thinning hair or balding hair or you just want your hair to look a little bit thicker to just blend really well with any wig or closure or sew-in, then I would highly suggest getting the Topic. Now I went ahead and added a little bit of concealer to my tiny, tiny, tiny piece of hair line that was left out my own little natural part and I'm going to go ahead and I did fluff it out with my fingers and I'm going to use some of my Ampro olive oil styling gel just a tiny bit for my actual leave out with my famous toothbrush that I love to use so as you see this is a full lace all the way through so you can part this baby anywhere you choose it gives you that scalp natural look appearance which I really think is cool because it does look like it's growing out of my scalp depending on which way I want to style it so there's loads of different things you can do with this unit you can twist it up especially for when it is dreadfully hot outside like it has been here I really don't like the summer heat too much in Arizona 113 degrees will kill me and I also like to do a braiding method with it which is just corn rolling the hair down it gives a really really natural look and I absolutely love it and it's great for the heat you can either tuck the hair over as such like this and give yourself a headband or you can do both sides or like I like to do sometimes is I'll take the hair and I'll tuck it and I'll actually put it inside the wig in the nape area so that way you don't see any braid on the outside and it looks like something totally different like this and give yourself a nice cool summer hair Okay guys, now the only downfall with this actual unit that I wasn't too happy about, which I actually tweaked and corrected, was the parting. The parting, um, the knots were a little bit too big for my liking. So I went ahead and used a pair of my tweezers while, tweezers, while the hair was wet and um, tweezed out some of the hair in the part. So that way I didn't have to put as much concealer on it as the norm and also it could just look a lot more realistic. So it does blend really well now, and if you're concerned about, well, I tweezed the part, the part isn't really that big that I tweezed, it's very minimal. I just remo removed those extra knots that were kind of laying in the passageway. Um, they were kind of knotty to me, so that was the one thing that I needed to correct. Other than that, the wig is really great quality. I will suggest when you get these wigs that you do wash them beforehand. Some companies do, 
um, send great wigs where you don't need to wash them, but it all depends on the hair texture. And as for any type of curly hair, I would always suggest to wash it because when you get the actual unit, the curls are kind of stiff and they're very uniform and they look a little bit unnatural. So I always deep condition or rather just condition the hair once I get it. So that way the curls look like they're more natural curls um, opposed to them being so stiff, hard, and uniform and kind of like processed basically so it is 26 inches which is long um, and being that it is curly right now of course it doesn't look like it's 26 inches but I'm pretty sure this hair would be able to be flat iron really easy because it is like a silky texture um, so I wouldn't think that it's going to poof up but it is a lot of hair um, once you finger comb or fluff it out it does get a little bit bigger as you notice um, it is 140 to 150 per, uh, percent density in this unit. So I did get a few extra goodies, which was the combs and the eyelashes strips that came in the package. But you also do get free shipping on every order over $119. So if you think about it, the units are probably more than $119, so you'll automatically get free shipping. I'll post their all information, all their information below. I'm not really sure what's wrong with me today. I'm just like tongue tied to the max. I don't know if it's the heat from these lights, but oh my gosh I am like tongue tied to the max but yeah so this is the virgin Brazilian and it is the curly unit 26 inches and it is in a natural color um, as for any shedding the only shedding that I noticed was when I was actually tweezing it which hair came out and I did notice a little bit of shedding when I was co-washing it because I do brush the hair I like to make sure that the conditioner is saturating into the hair but other than that, it's been okay. This is, like I said, the first unit that I've ever worked with from Jenny Lace Wigs. And hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. All the information will be posted for you below. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe, and thumbs this video up. And of course, I'll talk to you guys on my next video.